have you ever gone in for an audition where you were so prepared, you were so passionate, you gave it your all, you know you nailed it, they were, you could see their eyes light up and you didn't get it, and then there's the other where you're like, oh, I didn't do very good, and you get it. Yeah. And so it's that weird thing where... Being a producer now and being behind the scenes, you realize that there are so many, um, what's the, the term, Pol politics are involved as well. Uh, a, a lot of times it is apples versus oranges. It has nothing to do with you or your performance. Um, there are so many aspects. That's why as an actor you should just focus on what you need to do and just be your best because the politics involved might be that you weren't right for it. Um, you know, you could be in a film with Tom Cruise and you're just too tall and Tom Cruise doesn't like to work with, you know, an actor who's too taller than him, even though you were phenomenal, you know, and you're like, oh, I can, I can work shorter, you know, it just, there's other issues involved that don't necessarily have to do with you and the performance that you, you gave. And one thing I learned about auditioning, or I learned to appreciate, which I didn't initially when I was starting out, is that that moment in that room is yours. There's no one directing you, editing you, saying anything, so it's kind of like being on stage. You have complete control of that performance in that moment. And when I started seeing auditions in that way, they meant so much more to me, as opposed to you know, so I know that we get into that mindset of like, oh, why don't they just hire me? I hate auditions, sitting around, and, you know, um, doing the whole, hi, yes, headshot, that whole, you know, traditional method of doing business that, you know, if you do it constantly, it sort of gets repetitive. But that one moment in the room when you start to do the performance, it's yours. And that's magical. So it's kind of like doing minuscule live performances, you know, on a daily basis. And it's made me appreciate auditioning so much more, even though I haven't auditioned for a while now because I've been producing Mission Park. But I do, I do enjoy them more so now.